Hi guys, how's it going? Yes, I know, it's been a long, long time. Um, it's been a year, can you believe it? it's been a year since I did a video? Time's gone so quick, like really quick. Um, I didn't realise until I actually just sat down. Um, so first of all, apologies because, you know, I should do better, I could do better. Um, but at the same time, you know, life gets in the way and yeah, you just kind of get sidetracked as it were. So what have I been doing for this past year? What has been going on in my life? Well, I travelled quite a lot. Vancouver, Seattle, Taiwan, Hong Kong, Madrid, Malta, Vienna, Bordeaux. I did a lot of traveling. I said to myself, you know what? I'm gonna do more traveling this year. I did a lot of day trips. Brussels, I took a flight to Geneva for the day. And then obviously I did regular um, holidays. So I went to Hong Kong for like two weeks and did Taiwan as well. I went to um, Vancouver for like 10 days drop down to Seattle to catch up with a friend. So um, yeah, I did quite a lot actually. It was a great year. Um, and to be honest, it would have been really good to document that, um, you know, but that's my mistake. So yeah, um, that's what's been going on with me in the past year. Um, but also I did a lot of um, cooking. Some of you may or may not know, I love to cook. And that's something that actually I was going to mention what I wanted to talk about. Because I love cooking, I also have this weird fetish which is uh, kitchen appliances. Um, and I'm sure some of you are laughing right now. Um, they are my thing. Um, and I'm pretty sure there isn't a kitchen appliance that Sage, because that's my favourite brand, has made that I don't have or haven't owned at some point. I got into buying Sage products, I think it was back in 20... 13 um, and since then I just you know I haven't stopped basically I currently have about 14 appliances I've sold probably about four appliances prior to that um, I have a bit of an addiction <laughs> during this period I'm gonna do like a review slash demonstration on some of them it might be beneficial for some people who are considering purchasing um, these particular items or maybe they have them and they're not as familiar with all the features or functions um so i just figured you know what i will do a slight um review demonstration on some of them um another thing that i wanted to mention was um what has been going on with me during lockdown i i had a holiday um that was planned which i went on and then i came back and i started back to work at the beginning of March we kind of split into our different teams you know for work just to minimize cr cross contamination between people um, and then obviously the government imposed lockdown was um, announced so therefore everyone's at home we work from home um, you know with within reason to what we can do because not everyone's job is possible to do at home. Um, so we do as much as we you know, possibly can. Yeah. So that's been going on. But then also we've been in lockdown now for six weeks. It feels maybe like two. During this whole period, basically I've done a lot of housework, which I'm sure a lot of people have been doing. Purging, just purging everything. I've probably spent more time in the kitchen than I do in my bedroom, to be honest. Um, I'm cooking all the time, and I'm cleaning all the time in the kitchen, constantly, constantly creating dishes, which for me I find, you know, enjoyable. I've done a lot and I've used a lot of my appliances, which is why I'm excited to um, potentially show you guys some of these going forward. Um, but yeah, so I've been doing that and then I decided to go on a juice cleanse because I've done it before um, and it works for me in the sense it just helps me to kind of recenter and rebalance. I don't know how some of you guys feel about that, um, but for me it works. Everyone has their thing. So once a year I try and do something where I'm cleansing, detoxing, whatever you want to call it. Um, so yeah, I use the Jason Vale um, juice plan. Now's as good a time as any to kind of get it done. Just because you, you really need a regular routine and um, my work doesn't really allow me to have a regular routine as it were because my hours are kind of up and down so in taking your juices at set times of the day um, it makes it difficult especially with the type of job that I do so um, I figured during this time now's as good a time as any I'm doing the five day plan you can do a three day five day and seven days you have four juices in a day 
plus you have one shot which is their ginger shot it's just apple and ginger but trust me it really you know wakes you up they call it nature's espresso um so yeah you have your four juices a day two of them are the same so you basically have your breakfast juice and your dinner juice which are the same and then you have your lunch juice and your afternoon snack juice um, so it's 10, 1, 4 and 7 and then you're allowed what they call a, a juice SOS, mm -hmm. juice bar um, or um, you can have like an avocado which is what I like to do. I have that with a cup of herbal tea, peppermint tea um, with just a little bit of manuka honey and that, that just sets me for the evening. What I did to prepare for this, I committed to kind of cutting down on sugars and sweets and things like that. Um, just so that I could prepare myself. First day is generally fine. But normally the second day for me is the most difficult because you feel a bit tired, you feel, um, you know, you do get a bit of a headache. I find that the herbal tea helps. So I usually have a peppermint tea and that just helps a little bit because the, the hot drinks, they kind of um, start to quash the hunger pains that you get. And I think that's what it is that's making you feel that way. I see my third day. Um, yeah, I felt fine today. I feel great. Um, also, you know, I'm doing a little bit of exercise during them. So I have a Nintendo Switch and I use Ring Fit and I cannot say enough good things about it. It is great, to be honest. I think it's such a good tool for people to use to stay active at home um, or to introduce them to exercise. Just, I'm not the type of person to work out at home. I'm more inclined to like focus more on the eating side of things than the working out side of things. So this is actually really, really good. You need to be prepared. Like when I'm doing it, I make sure that I'm in my workout gear and I've got my towel and I've got like a bottle of water ready. It's gonna get you going, you know, it gets a heart rate up. So yeah, um, I do that and that basically helps as well. Um, so yeah, for this plan, it, like I said, for me it's a cleanse, you know, just to kind of center myself, to detox and um, just feel a little bit um, lighter in the sense of health wise. I haven't really eaten terribly, but you know, it's very easy to snack as well. I make breakfast, lunch and dinner and everything that I have is cooked at home, fresh, which is something good that's come out of this because I'm constantly cooking food. That's what's been going on with me at the moment. That's my week. Um, tomorrow's my last day. I, I normally have a smoothie for breakfast. That is usually my regular routine because it's the easiest thing for me to do. So I will have my smoothie for breakfast. I will probably have um, a juice for lunch with something small. And then for dinner, I will have steak um, because I've got a nice piece of steak that I've been saving. And someday I'm gonna have a roast dinner because it's tradition, you know? Um, and for the Americans that may not be familiar with what a roast dinner is, Think of Thanksgiving dinner. Maybe not to the extent of Thanksgiving, but yeah, um, you know, you just have like your, your roast meat, your potatoes, your vegetables, gravy, Yorkshire pudding. <gasps> yeah, it's gonna be like my big treat for the week. So that's what's been going on with me during lockdown and this past year. Like I said, nothing majorly exciting, but hey, you know, figured why not share. Um, so yeah, stay safe, stay well, stay in. Um, you know, let's try and speed up this process to ending this lockdown and I'll see you guys soon. Bye! I have been 